Hey everyone, Phoenix here. Today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. When I made my how much damage can you do video, I actually had a couple of questions about how void affects damage, especially from other players. So I thought I would do a little video explaining how that works. So there is some math involved, but it's not too complicated. If you have more questions after this, just let me know in the comments and I'll see if I can address it. Void has three damage over time spells. Corruption, Destructive, Curse, and Corrosion. And what those actually do is when they're applied to a target, they decrease the target's damage reduction rating. So every creature and every player, you can see it right here, damage and crit damage resist rating. Mine's only 13 slash 10. But every creature also has that property, even if it's not displayed. Void, like I said, is going to lower that damage reduction rating and in essence, increase all damage inflicted on that target by lowering that rating. The math behind that is in the equation at the top of the screen. So this is assuming you're casting level eight spells. It does change based on the level of the spell you're gonna cast, but I assume if you're looking at this, you're looking at level eight spells. So that's what we're gonna stick with. So the three inputs to the equation are your void skill, the percent uh, void damage modifier or nether damage bonus for nether spells versus monsters or verse players. But we're gonna focus on verse monsters. So this one has plus 26% when buffed. And the third thing is your damage rating. So right now with this setup, my damage rating is 42. I can get it as high as 55 with the Corrupted Heart of Darkest Flame. Um, gets me to 50. And then a Luminance Crystal of Rare Armor Damage Rating gets me to 55. So that's what I used for this calculation, this setup right here. So you can see in the top, I have Corrupted Heart of Darkest Flame damage rating. So it's in percent, so 1.55 is equal to a 55 damage rating. Void skill, 575. And then the wand modifier on this is 35% or 1.35. And the equation is just 27 times the damage rating times the void skill divided by 1,000 plus 1. And then void modifier on the wand, 1.35, just multiplied across. So when I'm using this, Corrupted Heart of Darkest Flame, I get a decrease in the target's damage reduction rating of 69.2, which I think is pretty good. And then when I use my Oak Energy Crystal, which has some Paragon and it's OD uh, zero because it's a VR Void Wand, it's going to be 62.2. So it's a small decrease, but it does add up, uh, especially in large group content. So I'll show you some of this in action. When you cast all three. Of course, I made my window really small. So now that I have all three on, I deal 1750, 1800 damage without a crit. And then if I go to one with no... um. No void debuffs. Ideal 760, 647, critical for 1400. So it's over a 100% increase in damage because of that, lowering the target's damage reduction rating. I hope that made sense. Pretty quick video just going through these basics of what void magic does. If you have any questions or need me to clarify this equation a little bit more, just let me know in the comments and I'll try to answer down there. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video.